Alright guys, back again, and welcome to part 2 of my Atari 2600 collection, where I'm going to be showing you guys probably the most interesting part, and that is my games. I have exactly 100 of them, like I said in my previous, you know, part 1, of course. So I'm really looking forward to showing you guys. So, I guess now it's just a matter of time before I move the camera and really show off all the different games I have. So let's go ahead and do that, and I hope you guys enjoy. Alright guys, so like I mentioned, I have a lot of games to show you, so in order to show them all in one video, I'm just going to go ahead and start right now. So here we go. We have Demon Attack. I have another copy of Demon Attack. This one is the picture version. This one has the text on it, as you can see the difference there. Yeah. But both are the exact same game, just a label variation. Dragonfire, great game. Star Voyager, I also have this for the NES. Trick Shot, which is a pool game. Not terribly exciting. Cubert. Star Wars The Empire Strikes Back. Reactor, which is a pretty bad game actually, I didn't really like it. Frogger, my opinion the best arcade port on the Atari 2600. Popeye. Venture, Donkey Kong Jr., Donkey Kong, this only has two of the four levels in the arcade game, which I think is kind of lame, but they probably couldn't fit all four on an Atari cartridge, so I guess for the time they did the best they could. Mousetrap. Worm War 1, which is a god-awful, lousy game. Stampede. Endoro. Grand Prix. Frostbite, Tennis, Ice Hockey, which I kind of think is overrated. I really didn't like it as much as the other sports games on the Atari 2600, but it's not a bad game at all. I just think it's kind of overrated, but that's my opinion anyway. Pitfall, just as good as everyone says. Dragster, which I really didn't like that that much. Kaboom, the best paddle game on the system, for sure. Um, Laser Blast. Freeway, one of Activision's best. If you like Frogger, definitely check out this game. Keystone Capers. Boxing. Which, that game is more fun if you're playing with an actual human being, but it's kind of boring if you're playing alone. Skiing. Star Master, I gotta figure out how to play that one in order to really enjoy it, but for now I think it's kind of boring. Commando, S 
Space Jockey. Commando Raid. Word Zapper. Minor 2049er. Summer Games. California games here which was put on many many different systems back in the day Super Challenge Baseball Astro Blast which is basically Astro Smash for the Intellivision it's pretty much the same game International Soccer Super Challenge Football Dig Dug Flag Capture Moon Patrol Another copy of Qbert, this one is the Atari licensed red label version Just another label variation of course Maze Craze Whoa, stack fell <laughs> um, Real Sports Football have here Haunted House Crystal Castles I have two copies of Pac-Man one is the Sears Telegames label ver version one is the Atari version exact same game like I said label variation Two copies of Home Run, one is the text label, another one's the picture. Two copies of Combat, one's with the picture, one's with the text. Video Pinball. Raiders of the Lost Ark. Race, which this is the game that uses the driving controllers. This is also known as Indy 500, just with the Sears brand name on it. Space Combat, which is kind of like combat with spaceships, actually. It's not that bad. Warlords. Golf. This game is ridiculous. <laughs> such a primitive game but you know I don't have it so I mean I have a copy of it anyway um, the Sears label of Space Invaders the Atari red label version of Space Invaders the Atari text version of Space Invaders and last but not least the Atari picture label version of Space Invaders the exact same game on all four cartridges, just with different label variations. Defender 2. Adventure. Arcade Golf. Berserk. Defender Kangaroo, which is a kind of a funny game actually, just a kangaroo of freaking boxing gloves. I really didn't understand this, but whatever. 
<laughs> um, pole position, which I think Endoro is a better game, but that's still not that bad. Bowling. Yar's Revenge. Star Raiders. Real Sports Baseball. Dodger Cars. I have two copies of Casino. One's with the picture. The other one here is with the text, as you can see there. Breakaway 4, which is the Sears version of Breakout, which I have the Atari label of. And this is obviously the Sears label, because it says Telegames on it. Target Fun, which was the pack-in game for the Sears Telegame system, which is essentially Air-Sea Battle. Another copy of Bowling, this one is the Sears label. Demons to Diamonds, pretty trippy game actually. I have two copies of Missile Command, one's the Atari version, one's the Sears version. Basic Programming. Ms. Pac-Man. Night Driver. Centipede. Asteroids. Jungle Hunt. Sprint Master, Circus Atari, the god awful ET the Extraterrestrial. I have two copies of Basketball, one's with the picture and one's with the text. And the last two Atari games I have are Video Olympics and the identical game for the Sears Telegame system, Pong Sports. So that's it. That's all the Atari 2600 cartridges that I own. Like I said, guys, that was going to take a really long time to get through. So I apologize for the kind of long video here. But I really wanted to show you guys every single game that I had, and I really hope you enjoyed. So thank you very much for watching my Atari 2600 collection video, guys. And as always, have a great day.